start with Exiled. EDAs. For example, you can download Rider or Visual Studio. Either will work. You can download it from their websites. We will use Visual Studio because it's free. Project setup. Create a new project. Search.net. Click on class library. .NET Framework, type your project name, select the latest version, and click Create. You have successfully created your project. Nugget Packages To add our Nugget Package, which basically we will go here, to Manage Nugget Packages, go to Browse, type Exiled, and install Exiled Official. And click Apply. Okay. When you do this, you have it like this. I have package config again, so I will migrate it. And now you see I have Excel official like this. To fix the problem, you can uninstall the Nugget package and again install it. Code moment. The whole code will be available at GitHub. You need to start by replacing these all useless usings with important ones. Exiled API features and Exiled loader. At the end of public class, you add double dot plugin config now you want to right click your project click add click new item name it config.cs and add you want to remove all these useless usings again and replace it with excel api interface now you replace internal class with public class. Now add double dot iconfig. Now we want to add public ball is enabled and these little brackets get set and public ball debug. This is the whole config file and now going to the main file again. We want to add public override void two times and open it. And we want to override the methods on enabled and on disabled. Inside the methods, we now add base dot and the method name. So now we create public static class one instance, and in methods create instance is equal this, and instance is equal null. We want to create a new folder. Right click my plugin two. Go to Add, New Folder, and name it Event Handler. Handlers. Now, inside Event Handlers, go right click it, Add, and New Item. And this will be called your event name. So for me, I want to connect event name called Verified. All available events can be found on the GitHub page in Exiled, Exiled Events, Event Arcs, and here we have the list. I want to make a welcome message that is in Player, and the event I want to use is here verified event arcs okay so now in our verified script we want to do public static class verified and in here 
going to do public static void. Basically, do our method, which I will use verified. And it's verified event arcs and our prefix, which we would want to use to specify player ever and open it. I chose verified because on exiled page in player we see here verified, which basically when Nerfoot servers verify that player actually joined the server then the event will play. Now we see that it is red because it is the same as class so we need to do on verified and in our main class we want to link it now which we link it by specifying where the event is so using player is equal exiled dot events dot handlers dot player so we don't have to write all this but just player so we want to specify player dot verified and here plus equal and where the event is in our project so it is in event handlers, verified, class, and on a verified method. So event handlers dot verified dot on verified. And we connected our event. But now we want to do the same in on disabled, but with unconnecting it because it could do really bad things to our server. Now, when the player is verified, we want to send him a message that he joined X server. server. How do we do that? We use this prefix. This prefix could be actually everything, if we would want, but we will keep it simple, like ever. Simple for event. So ever. And this event has player in it, here, player, and it has only player, nothing else. So we will use f.player, and now we want to show him that this all purple cube is what you can do with the player, but we want to show, hint him. And in the show hint, we want message, you joined my epic server. Thank you. Smiley face. And in here, we want to specify the duration. The duration is normally 3 seconds, if you don't want to specify it. But I want to have it 8 seconds. And then semicolon. To build a plugin, you hit My Plugin 2 and Build. Then you will find it when right clicking My Plugin 2, open folder in File Explorer, and here in Objects, Debug, we find our great plugin. Uh, there could be a uh, more to it, like releases, x64, it's basically what you set here. So if I would want release, and then build it, you can do it like this, and it will be now in releases, here. Now we join our localhost. And get the message. You joined my epic server. Thank you. Yeah, no worries. <laughs>